reason for changing from BDS to this was mainly because I had uh, developed a love towards marketing in general. So it was a very tough uh, situation for me to choose this because my family was not completely cooperating. They were very afraid that I am shifting a field completely, going from a small pond to jumping into an ocean with so many opportunities, so many risks and everything. So it was hard to convince them on uh, why I wanted to do this. They were under the belief that I wanted to do this for the money part but I think I could have earned more when I was in BDS itself. But I chose this because I started developing the passion towards marketing in there. Maybe because I have seen my dad since I was growing, growing up, he was a management person in general. So that started my love on all together in management. So that is why I plan to shift towards this but it was also one of the tough decisions to choose which and where. So which course should I choose and where should I do this course. So first I thought of doing it as uh, MIS or MIM going abroad, settling over there and everything. But then I thought why going abroad? I heard that the management in uh, India is better than anything else. So I started uh, finding out what all management institutes I can do. Then I started applying for CAT, ZAD, the regular all, uh, all things every MBA aspirant goes on. So in that way I started uh, my journey towards uh, this MBA career. It had so many ups and so many downs, very new things I have experienced from the uh, my old undergraduate college. In my old undergraduate college there is nothing known as student owned campus or student run campus. So this is completely new part of XLR I am experiencing. So that was very new for me. For us there were no committees, now I have come to know there are so many committees and everything, the campus life, everything is new to me. I was a day scholar so I just had the life of a cat block in my old college. Now I am a hosteler so even the hostel life is new. So these are the new things I am experiencing whereas it's not like there are no challenges. The past 5 months we had so many challenges. We had SIPs to go through. I was uh, running out of sleep for so many times. The sleep was uh, like on par at 4 hours, 5 hours. For me it was very less because I used to sleep a lot. So that part was un one and another was everything is new to me in this field. I have no idea what uh, everyone is talking about. Someone talks about finance, I have no idea about finance and I am uh, very least interested in finance. So that is a new part. When they are talking about st stock market, I am completely out of it. I can't connect. What are they talking? I can't understand. So that is one part. And another is uh, uh, mingling with people was kind of tough for me because even though I'm outspoken, they couldn't connect with me in some part. And everyone is from very wide, wide regions and very vast uh, all over India. Everyone is here. But how do I talk to them? How do I connect with them in which they are uh, interested in talking to me too? So all these challenges, one by one, one by one. I think I'll tackle most of it. Maybe I'll tackle more of it. I'm not sure. So this is how I experienced my life at XLR. So far, it's really good and I expect to be the same.